Oh, definitely not a good map for us. A really, really large map. Definitely not good for like a one perk game. Because these are the games you definitely want to have multiple perks. Upstairs. Oh. They heard me immediately and bounced. That's fine. I gotta get rid of this and probably leave. Not there. Cool. If they have good call outs, I'll be in trouble. Alright, so it's one of these areas here. Right over here. Oh, I'm out in the open though. Can I get like a better angle here? There we go. Nice. All right. That's probably a one gen loss overall, depending on how well they split up. Possibly two if they really, really split up. Cool. Here we go. Play against that Bill before? Uh, yeah, but I don't know who that is. So that one doesn't bother me. I've played against plastics in a lot of different situations. Always a very solid survivor. Unless I know you, I don't really think much of it. Problem here is that we leave really, really quickly. And you're laggy. That's fine. We keep the same energy here or do I will leave? I leave. Question is can I catch off classics here? We have about three gens ready to go. Not too bad. Cool. We're at two gens roughly right now. I'm about to be careful. I can't really go for a slug play too much either. I can kick that gen, kick that gen, and then maybe try and play off of that. See if we'll get a little bit of base regression to feel good. Hard to say. And we have the uh, Fang Min here, who is uh, probably back here working on this gen with the... Wee? I said Fang, I meant Nia. Cool. There we go. I see. Can I get a two for one here? They have a healing boon up. Keep that in mind. Get rid of that. Like I said, we're at two gens right now, so I'm not too horribly worried about this. And we're definitely put the game not in our favor. But there's Nancy. Because that gen's done. This gen's almost done. We're actually almost at one gen. Is that hard gaming? That was dumb on me to even swing at that. I know better 100% of the time. That's fine. She'll block it here.
Nope. go. Got it. We have an unbreakable player. There's almost always an unbreakable. Damn. What was that? <laughs> Let's make them use their unbreakables. I know that seems silly, but I think I want to get over here before they get everybody up, yeah. Oh wow, I fucked it up. There we go, come on. Spin, 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 spin. Thank you. One, two. Okay. Really quick, while we have time. Oh, I waited. Oh, that sucks. I waited so long on that, too. Made for this. It wasn't that hard. I think that was made for this. We have to be, we have to play that very careful there because they're trying to just get into a situation where they constantly get like lots of saves and stuff. We also wanna be careful of maybe a double flashlight. It looks like they're meeting up probably in that corner to heal up. Hi. Hold that for me. We try and sound the killer, but you just look really, really bad. Okay. We want to be sliding in these uh, hooks when we can. Because they're going to try and heal up and probably keep the Nancy alive. Hi. What's up? <laughs> Got it. Don't have decisive. Cool. That's one. Boone's up again, probably. They got really quick healed. Yeah, you're not wrong. There has to be a boon up. Dude, good thing we kicked this gen a while ago, right? Look at the gen's progress now. This is why you kick a gen in moments of like really quick uh, pressure and you're not sure what the survivors have and they can bounce back from it. Got me. Inside main building. They might also meet up over here. Hold up. Ah! 
There we go. Let's hook up, kick that gen, and then move on. We're going to lose one gen here soon. By the way, you can do that here because of the uh, gen hides your snarls. Quick little note. She doesn't have Unbreakable anymore, so we should be good. So there might be a boon. I guess that's possible. There we go. Sometimes all it takes is a group just to get a little altruistic, and you can shut it down. Very hard group to beat here, though, too. They probably style on a lot of killers. Oh, there you go. And by the way, much love again to Plastics. Always a really, really strong survivor. And normally, when they're playing in a group, it's going to be a really hard game. It's not a bully squad. That's probably what you would call a bully squad. They were looking for plays. That's the only thing I call a bully squad, but I don't really care about bully squads. <laughs> 